A hoon whose wild ride ended in a fiery crash in Mirabuka is on the run from police tonight. Witnesses say his car reached speeds of up to 150 kilometres an hour before smashing into a power pole. A normally quiet Sunday night on Honeywell Boulevard. Then sparks fly as a hoon smashes into a power pole. The driver of this Nissan 200SX allegedly trying to flee from police. As dangerous electric cables dangle, the car flips, landing 100 metres away. Seconds later, police arrive drawing residents from their homes. Incredibly, the driver and his passenger managed to escape and run from the wreck. Tonight, they're yet to be caught. Witnesses say the same car was spotted earlier doing burnouts at Mirabuka Village car park, where they first attracted the attention of police. Witnesses say the car was travelling at up to 150 kilometres an hour when the driver lost control, but locals say speeding here is not uncommon, with hooning becoming a real problem. The beach road itself is just like a drag strip. Especially in the wet weather, they can't control their cars. They're idiots. They should crush the car in front of them. Western Power and DFES were at the crash site today, working for five hours to replace the damaged pole. Police say it's unclear whether the car was stolen and they're yet to lay charges. Jerry DeMassey, Nine News.